In the forest, color is a code. It is clear, red touches yellow. Venom lives here. Nature speaks in warning stripes, every band tells a story. Coral snakes belong to the Elapidae family, the same as cobras and mambas. The eastern coral snake, Microris fulvius, slithers from North Carolina through Florida to Louisiana. Unlike other vipers that destroy tissue, coral snakes silence nerves. Their short, fixed fangs inject three-finger neurotoxins and phospholipase A2, blocking every breath signal until muscles fail. The old rhyme says, red on black, friend of Jack. But that is also a myth. Science rewrites the verse, red on black may still attack. Several venomous coral snakes have red bands that directly touch black bands. Examples include M. Stewarti and M. Ruitanis. Therefore, the U.S. rhyme, red on black, friend of Jack, does not generalize beyond its narrow region and must not be used for identification elsewhere. They're shy, fossorial hunters feeding on small reptiles. When threatened, they coil, hide the head, and wave the tail, a living warning sign. One drop of some coral snake's venom can paralyze a mouse at 0.3 micrograms per gram. Victims may feel fine, then lose the ability to breathe hours later. How to act if bitten. What not to do. First, forget the movie myths. Do not panic. Fear increases your heart rate and spreads venom faster. Don't cut the wound, and don't try to suck the venom. Also do not apply ice at the wound or try to wrap a tourniquet. And finally, don't chase or handle the snake. Stay calm, slow your breathing. Keep the bite below heart level and the limb still. Call 911, do not drive yourself. Snake bites are medical emergencies, but most people survive when they act fast and smart. If you like our content follow us, because prevention starts with knowledge.